Guys, they said Toby's mom was humiliated out of uh, on those state women meeting for what she and her daughter have been doing to Queen Naomi, allegedly. According to the information reaching us, we heard that uh, this uh, uh, Queen Naomi and uh, Toby came from the same state, from Ondo State, even though it's not from the same town. And the women, you know that this is the season of women's meeting everywhere in the world. Yes. And this is the time they normally seize the opportunity to tackle some issues, especially those that concerns their people. And we all know that this uh, Toby and Kwenami, they are well-known people in Ondo State generally. And I believe that these women are seeing what is going on in their marriage with KBAC. Because normally, what they're supposed to be doing when they gather like this is to celebrate uh, my, uh, as in my stone, as in celebrate how far their daughters have gone. Getting married to first class Oba is a big thing, you know. So they are supposed to be celebrated. But instead, what they keep getting is complaint upon complaint upon complaint about how these people are fighting these people, how Toby is ganging up against Queen Naomi, uh, conniving with all of this solo reason the palace to fight Queen Naomi. And they are not happy with it at all. And I believe that they really want peace. If not that they want peace, they might not decide to tackle the uh, issue. Or, or maybe in, get themselves involved in the issue, but they want peace. You know, they would be happy to hear that uh, the two daughters from their state that is married to KBAC, they are doing well. They are living together. They are cooperating very well. That's the kind of news that they, they want to be hearing. And they said this uh, this meeting, uh, Quinomi's mother is part of it. Um, Toby's mother too is part of the meeting, you know. So when they finish up with their agenda, they brought up this particular issue to tackle it. They decided to advise Toby's mother, you know, to talk to her daughter. That no matter what is happening in that marriage, that Queen Naomi have been there before her. And it's enough a reason for her to uh, respect Queen Naomi. But if there's anything that Queen Naomi is doing to her that is not good, that she can do well to report to them. That they know that Queen Naomi is a good woman who would listen if there's anything like that, that if they talk to her, she will listen and she will obey the women because they know her very well, that she's not a troublesome person. You know, she is a good woman. They know her as they have invited her on several locations and all of that. So they can tell the kind of person she is. But as for Toby, they are not trying to say that she's a bad person, but they don't know her that much. But if not for anything, for the fact that Naomi was in that marriage before her, that is enough reason for her to respect Queen Naomi, then if Queen Naomi is not doing well, she can complain and they are sure they, they are going to handle it and make sure that they all live in peace in KBSC's house. Yeah, my people, they said the moment they say that Queen Naomi is a peacemaker, she doesn't like trouble, they know her and all of that, they said uh, Toby's mom pick offense. So it was a serious offense. They said she was telling them that, look, oh, are they trying to say that her daughter is a troublesome person? That her daughter is not a troublesome person. That the, the fact remains that the that uh, uh, Queen Naomi is trying to show her that she knew rich. And she, that have two, two children for KBAC, as a matter of fact, that Queen Naomi is supposed to worship her in that palace for, give, give, for giving KBAC uh, 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 twins. That there is no how... As a matter of fact, all the wife, they are supposed to be bowing for her daughter because the gods have blessed her daughter big time in that family. A blessing they never give to any one of these soloists. That they all know that Kwenomi doesn't like good things. That Kwenomi is jealous of her daughter because her daughter... Yeah? They said it was a serious thing. No? These people were just advising this woman to talk to her daughter so that there won't be problem between her daughter and Kwenomi in the in Kabiasi's palace. And that is where they say she started blasting on every one of them. If anyone tries to calm her down to let her know that it has got it hasn't gotten to that extent, to that extent that all they are, uh, 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 what all they all wanted is for peace to reign. You know they want to achieve peace between these two daughters of theirs. 
that that is how the woman will start tackling that person. Hey, you guys are jealous of her. That you people are jealous of her because her daughter is married to the king and her daughter stays in her husband's house. That uh, Queen Nomi have said she's no longer interested in this marriage. Why is she now a problem for her daughter in the marriage? Why is it that Kabyas is giving everything to her son and Kabyas is not looking at her daughter's side? That her daughter is only looking for, uh, is only fighting for her children's rights. That the daughter is not in any way insulting Queen Naomi. All she is asking for is her rights. Her rights. Her right after all, her children deserve to get something from their father but when i have used her juju to make kbsc to be giving everything to tate Nikawo, that is it a crime that is there any one of them in amongst them who will not fight to get what is uh, rightfully their children's own yay they said the way her mouth was running that is when one of them that talks the way she talks also told her that look it is obvious that you are the one encouraging your daughter, daughter to fight Queen Naomi. They said Queen Naomi's mother did not even want her a word. You will not even know that she was in that meeting. She did not say a word. Pim. <laughs> they say one of them picked it on top of her head and told her that it is now obvious that they now know who is advising this your daughter. That it is you who is fighting Queen Naomi from the shoulder of your, your daughter. That it is obvious that you send your daughter there for a property. Not because she loved the king. And that is why she is fighting everyone because of the same property. That you are not worthy to be among them. That you are this, you are that. They said the two of them started giving themselves bars because you know women now. If you know my own, I know your own. That is how they started. <laughs> At some point, they decided they ordered her to leave the meeting for them. That she's a nuisance. She's causing noise in the environment. That they don't need her in the meeting again. That she should leave. They said she, she said she's not going anywhere. If they try her, she's going to show them she's an in-law to Kabyas. Hey, my people, don't be smart, you know. Hey, hey. And some they have to push her out. They said the way they push her out, they forget that she's an in-law to Kabyas. <laughs> and at that point, they decided that they are going to send delegates to go to the palace and give this information direct to their daughter, that they don't want to hear that she is having problem with, with Naomi again, that whatever is the case, that she can come to them, that they are assuring her they are going to settle whatever it is that is between her and the Queen Naomi. After all, it is somehow to hear that two people from the same state that got married to uh, Kabyesi is messing up, that they are fighting each other, that it doesn't make sense. It doesn't give, it doesn't tell well about their people. You know, they need to represent the Ondo state women very well, they, wherever they are. So they decided to send two people, a bit three people, to go to the palace and deliver the message. But the problem is, if they deliver the message, is Toby going to listen? Because it is obvious that her mother is the one pushing her. Yes, her mother is the one telling her, don't worry, go, fight, nothing will happen. I am solidly behind you, this and that. You are fighting for your children's rights. Ever since she started fighting, have she gotten every, anything? That's the question that the mother did not ask herself. Eh? These women are trying to make peace, and you are there telling them that Queen Naomi is just jealous because your daughter has the twins and Queen Naomi have one. <laughs> and the one is receiving everything. The twins is not receiving anything. Anyway, guys, I want to remind you that these are all alleged information, okay? Always bear that in mind. Give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel and share this video. Bye. I love you guys.